Hi, I'm Hilda here, Hilda from Hilda Crafty. Uh, in my previous video, I showed you how to make texture on a bottle. And in this video, I'll show you how to make letters. Now, for this, first of all, you take the bottle on which you've made the texture and write whatever word you want. I've written love, L-O-V-E, with a pencil and I've made a simple heart. And now, for, for the letters that you want to write, first of all, take tissue paper, tear it into half. I've already done that and take a bowl or just we need a wet towel just dip it in water squeeze it fold the towel take the tissue paper which is in half again fold it put it on the towel and start rolling be very soft on the fingers no pressure just start rolling now the thickness will depend on how thick you want the letter to be if you want it thin, keep rolling. Otherwise, whichever size or shape, uh, th thickness that you want, leave it there. Now, I want it a little thinner, so I'll keep rolling. And if the paper, uh, the tissue paper breaks in between, it doesn't matter because we anyway have to cut it for the letters. So, this is how you'll keep doing. This is how you will get it. Now, you have to allow this to dry for some time. So, I have already made some, so which I will use now. So, for the letter L, now I will take the one which is dry. And wherever, now I, the L is still here. So, I will mark it. And then I will cut it. I will take the uh, fevicol. Just draw it fix it up again for the lower portion of the L I'll take mark it till I want till where I want it cut I'll cut it take the glue fix it now for the O again I'll measure it take the glue go over the outline for the V again I'll measure it cut it it again for this side sorry I forgot to measure first you have to first measure it I went a bit wrong here here then for the E measure it Again, I'm doing the wrong thing. I'm eyeballing it. You can even press it, measure it with your nail. I usually do that. This is how you will stick. Now, if you want a symbol at the back, first you allow this to dry and then you turn it. Now, but I'm doing it now anyways to show you all. So, draw the outline and I've already measured it, measured this heart. So, I'll quickly fix it. So, I didn't want the video to be too long. So, I've already measured and I kept it. So, this is how you will do it. You can even give it a nice shape. So this is how it will be. 
and once you've done now this has to be nice and dry very nice and dry and before you start painting just make sure that all the letters are nicely fixed from the corners so like this is coming once it's dry just take the glue nicely fix it allow it to dry and then you start painting because otherwise it will start popping out once it's painted now this is dry absolutely dry so now what you have to do is just color black i'm again going with black just take start painting Make sure that all the corners and all are very well painted around the letters, inside, out, everywhere. Nicely painted. I'm not doing the entire bottle. But just be very, very particular about the corners of this, where the symbol or the letters are. Nicely painted. So this is how it will be. So I've already painted one bottle and it is nice and dry like this. Once it's dry, again we'll do the golden or this time why not we try bronze. So I'll try bronze this time. Again take the color. This technique all I have shown in my previous video. So you can have a look at the previous video for this. So just take the color, the highlight color, take it all out. And just slowly, just gently start painting on it. So for in this, which I've done earlier, I've done the V and E little crooked. You can do whichever you want, whichever way you want. Now I just want the letters to be dark. So I'm removing all the color. And I'll just slightly brush it. Just gently brush it. And again, for the heart, I want it a little dark. So I will just make the heart a little dark. But it's your choice. If you want the entire bottle to be dark with the symbol, with the word, it's your choice altogether. I just want the symbol and the word to just pop out. So I'm doing more color on that. Then I'll remove all the color out and I'll gently brush on the bottle, on the texture. So that just the texture comes out. You can go for any word you want. You can go for hope, joy, any word that you want. You can write your name also on this. So this is how it's going to look. And uh, with another video, but if you think that this bottle is done, I think we can do a little bit more. For that, I'll make another video. Do tune in. Bye-bye and I love you all.